around somewhere, probably should work on a settler. I mean, we could drop a city here. It's really not the most exciting. It will have floodplains wheat, and then a bunch of desert resources, one fish. We could stay on three city, but I would like some more growth going if we do that. Um, let's go and work on the Parthenon then, and here we go slide in a horseman. Chop that into the horse, which brings it down to four turns. Go to heal, and well, I'll bring this guy over this way. There's no way that Austria is going to go and attack through Wittenberg. They could diplomary it eventually, uh, but I don't think that's going to happen too soon. Although if they do have a lot of units, it is a major choke point here, so I, I'm not too worried. Um, but that could potentially make a little trouble for us. Ah, uh, yes, that's a good um, suggestion there. OP Reach or OP Reich. Uh, I could go and grab sailing to build some triremes, and then go and do some exploration here. Find myself a nice island, use my unique ability, get some spices or nutmeg going. Alright, so we finished the National College, let's pop out a quick worker. And uh, a stable would also be good. We do have the three, four pastures once we uh, improve the sheep. So we'll go worker, I'll go work on the sheep, and then we'll get the stable online. Should go and irrigate that floodplain. So we do have some units, and we're going to have a whole bunch. We have a whole bunch pre-built in Surabaya, but if I go and attack now, it means my production will be used up when I want to be building universities. I mean, I'm not there yet, but I could be there in 6, uh, 11, 19 turns. And uh, if we start a war now, it definitely won't be finished in 19 turns. So sitting back might be the boring option. Uh, let me know in chat. It, it does, it is definitely the better plan here. Since we do have the stronger lands, we should sit back and let them work to our advantage. And we can go and clear that tire. Unnamed unknown worker. That uh, was probably that city states. Go drop a mine on that. This guy is working a lot of mines since um, he's getting his food from Surabaya. Uh, we could uh, eat turns food Parthenon, that's fine. It's not a high priority for me, but I may as well try to finish it. All right, so we don't need this horseman yet. Let's go toss a watermill out in front of that and circus while we delay and a barracks. Maybe even a market. How much gold are we making here? Three gold per turn? Eh. Good call there, Dark Reef. I almost let that horse pop out. I remembered in time though, I don't think the um, 
the delay would have actually let that advice get through in time, but fortunately we did manage the queue like I wanted. Alright, there goes my golden age. We're now only making one gold per turn. Let's get over this way. Hopefully we can get this worker captured by um, a barb and then return it to Mbanza Congo. Yeah, we can go and send that over to this encampment. That's what we'll do. Um, and with this guy, we'll just station ourselves here for safety's sake. And uh, yeah, we'll just hang out over here. That's fine. So you state quest wise, you got camp here and a camp here. Mogadeshu wants a trade route, which we could do by sea from Suribaya. And um, let's actually slow down Soul Service here. Go grab sailing and then pop back in. We'll get the cargo ship and uh, ability to build triremes. We'll pop a trireme out, probably from Surabaya. And then even a cargo ship from Mogadeshu. Extra food for these cities would be great. We've got plenty of happiness. Prog suit's a great scientist. Some dudes want a Petra. We've got sailing. We're only 3% above the average as far as techs go though. Um, let's menu um, options. Let's see, turn that off and see how we're doing. Oops, that's not what I want at all. Uh, options, interface options, multiplayer squash the list accept. Um, and see how we compare on population. We've got 20 pot versus 13 and 13. So we should be a lot further ahead on science here. Uh, they probably picked up some cheaper techs, um, but we are dominating on the expensive techs. At least that's what I'm telling myself. So here, let's go pop in a quick trireme and a cargo ship. Uh, okay, that's maxing out the queue. Or is it? Okay, it's not. We'll just remember to pop those guys back in later. Get that going. Trespassing in Mbatsa, Congo. She's production. What do we have here? We've got the worker done. Over in the capital, we can go and grab a writer's guild. That would be fine. I'm not in a rush to grab that. Definitely a market. A mint would also be fine since we're on silver. A uh, circus? Yeah, that's fine. No upkeep. I could and also probably should be swapping luxuries here. I don't need the happiness. Alright, see you Dark Eve, enjoy your lunch. Well, this has so far been a pretty relaxing introduction back into uh, the multiplayer Civ. Uh, we've got an amazing start, isolated, salty, only one neighbor, and one who's none too aggressive at the moment either. He's got a jungle start, which means it's a lot slower. He does have uh, some nice wheat there, some copper, some cattle. But overall, things are looking quite good, and uh, mostly thanks to the map. I mean, um, obviously, if I had no idea what was going on, I wouldn't be able to take advantage of our amazing lands here. 
So the state bonuses have changed. I'm sure the medieval like that sold the service up. We want, definitely want some more farms going. Let's pop over this way. Do some damage there. Get this worker over there. Hopefully that bar will capture it. And um, just fortify. Well, let's fortify on the hill so we can actually deal damage to any uh, incoming attackers, so should they try to siege at Surabaya, get some of these civil service enhanced farms online. And it's also time for a road network. Let's go. Grab ourselves another worker. I really should build some more cities. At the moment, I'm happy with things the way they are. I already have a national college up, so that's not stopping me. Um, it's just the thing is that all these city spots are so amazing that uh, this city spot just pales in comparison. It looks like complete garbage compared to uh, the other three. Uh, but another city does mean more production, more science. Um, of course, each progressive citizen costs more food, so uh, the early cities grow a lot faster. I do have the happiness to spare, although a lot of that is coming from my ally status, or Friends that with Tyre. They're good. The barbs did exactly what I wanted them to do. Came out and captured that worker so I can return it to Mbanza Congo. Let's go toss up a mine here. The Dan demands wines. These guys want gems. Can I get gems from anywhere? Not yet. Or if I try and look to finish, then it's into a cargo ship. We can pop in a stable, would not be bad either. Okay, so we do have, let's see, two potential irrigated farms that we could get going for Jakarta. And that does mean I'll probably want another worker to speed this along. Okay, we've just finished that pasture. Okay, these two guys can work on these two farms. Pop up here to prevent additional spawns and stop the bonds of Congo from clearing the camp themselves. And let's go island hunting. Alright, I don't really need that circus. I mean, it costs no upkeep, so there's no harm in having it. Let's go and grab none of this stuff. Chichen Itza is what I want. Wow, I haven't had a multiplayer game where I've been so free to spam wonders in ages. I also haven't played in ages, but. That's beside the point. This is most unusual. Alright, what do we want here? Um, additional gold. We don't have a lot of gold to be throwing at city states. Consulates isn't very good anymore since they reduced the pledge to protect amount. Um, I only have the one city state ally at the moment. I could toss an additional gold bit at Tyre. Uh, we could also open up commerce. Exploration wouldn't be bad if we're going to get naval action out of this map. Well, for now, let's go and open up commerce. That gets us another four gold per turn, which is not bad. And here, let's go and irrigate some more farms.
if we did want to send a Kaira ship to Mogadishu, um, that would be a risky proposition with this barbarian camp here. It could potentially spawn a bunch of barbarian naval units. Alright, so we go drop a farm on that. Take that down. And somehow we've rose to third on soldiers. A lot of units must have died there, or someone's going through a tech upgrade and they deleted a lot of their obsolete units. Okay, education in seven. Card has grown. Let's go and grab ourselves. Let's see. Uh, we do make some decent gold here. Let's grab a market. And then uh, maybe we'll also squeeze out a charming. I would like to scout this side of the map as well for islands. We'll go and pop that out. And here, let's go put a farm onto that hill. Let me some uh, nice production and food. And over this way, is it road time? No, I think we'll toss in another hill farm. Okay, when do I expand here? One turn. Put one turn into this mine and then we'll go work on the farm. All this looks okay. So, assuming no one clears that next turn, we can clear two camps, uh, return this unit. Excellent, now allied with Monza Congo. They gift, let's see, what's the timer on this thing? Um, pleasure protect, new military unit, but which? military unit, uh, the Mandicav. Cool. Alright, so here's Filthy Robot, I presume, as Japan. Looks like... Oh man, that is really close. Uh, Mr. Sink is holding out pretty well, apparently. But well, it's not pretty. Alright, so we can clear that. Or err. Very lucky with the city states here. And actually, given that we've just fulfilled a couple quests, um, opening up consulates wouldn't have been so bad after all. We could have been at uh, Alex's as with Ur there had we gotten consulates. But uh, that's not the kind of thing that you can anticipate. That was pure luck that that camp is down to one health. I mean, Having your units out on the map and looking around, it's pretty important. It lets you take advantage of situations like that, but there's no way I could have known that that was going to happen. Alright, so let's go and work on road. We'll put a road up in here and over here. Then, working on these hills, I do need to get this guy some food. We've got plenty of happiness. Alright, let's slow things down just a little. Put some extra trim on the market. That's fine. And, uh, yeah, let's get to look on this road. Alright, so Filthy is at 12th pop as well, versus our 23. Um, so, of the players that we've met so far, we are, uh, we definitely have a very strong advantage uh, for science, for, for production. Oh yeah. Japan's Hammers, Filthy Robot, is at 24. Uh, these guys have been fighting all game, but apparently they're crammed into a corner. I have no idea where the other two players are. Uh, probably to the south somewhere here? It's a very strange Pangea, especially, um, or particularly in that there's all this empty space in the middle. Okay, so here We've got um, the Greeks just to the south there. They settled to go and grab Old Faithful, which of course gives them three happiness. And it does look like things are cut off at the top. And let's explore north first. 
Alright, what do I want to do here? Mogadishu is too dangerous. Um, let's go and have a look at what our trade route options are. As far as money goes, trading from Medan to Prague would be quite profitable and uh, looks a bit safer. Well, actually it doesn't. There's uh, a definite chance that that would be killed right there. Um, well, Mogadishu is really dangerous. We could trade with Salzburg here. We would be giving away three science per turn. Um, let's just do that for now. It is safer. I don't want to have the cargo ship pillaged by barbs. So we're getting some gold per turn out of that. We're leaking a little science. Not a big deal. Um, it will be a bit of a pain. Um, I don't want him to get any info on my cap, so no thanks. But I did send him a cargo ship, so that's definitely an act of friendship. And uh, let's see, one turn from the mine, he'll go work on the farm then. Minor victory, eh. Let's find that island. Okay, so we've got a camp back here that we need to clear. And I do have a bunch of units pre-built in Suribaya, so I don't mind moving these two archers away. Looks like it's probably closed off. So this trireme is pretty much done. Um, just to be thorough, I should check here in case there's an island up here that I might settle for my unique ability. And it looks like Mr. Sink is about to expire. He's got probably just one unit left. Um, Asur is not taking damage yet, but um, his military is pretty much gone. Uh, but the early war between Mr. Sink and Filthy Robot um, will definitely set Filthy Robot back. Alright, someone's going to build Petra. Got some more floor expansions, for growth. Um, lock that down. Road time, and over to deal with that barb camp. Nothing to see here. We should try to grow certain by a little more. Um, if I do want to send cargo ships all the way around the continent here, I could settle a canal city, one, two, three, on this hill. It would have one fish. Okay, so <laughs> definitely not. In the archers in working on that road. Okay, deal from tank embassies. Um, I think I'm going to hold off on that. I don't know where his capital is, but I don't want him to know where mine is, since um, the longer I can keep my capital secluded, um, it means that he won't be able to plant spies in there uh, until the World Congress is founded. 
All right, as for roads, a road on the hill would be best so I can have uh, range shoots come in and out of there. I'll start the road here and just bring it in down a bit this way. Education in two. We'll get the universities up and online, and then we'll consider pushing out with the military afterwards. So after education, we'll go and try to grab Machu Picchu, try and go for Notre Dame, and then we'll pick up machinery just so we're not too greedy. Too greedy. Although, going astronomy, uh, we do have the two mountain cities. They are lower pop. I do need to get some more food improved around there. And I'm not going to rush astronomy since we're not going to have an outrageous amount of science in those cities yet. Um, we'll keep the tech path as it is for now. Need it from Mont Congo, a catapult. Thanks for nothing. All right, we've got 110 influence there in. Who else are we friends with? Ur and Tyre. Uh, ally status. Eighty nine. Let's go and gift, give that unit back to Mbanza Congo. Oops, that is not what I wanted to do. Give a gift, gift a unit, gift the catapult. And uh, since it's allied with us and near uh, Filthy Robot, having extra units on Mbanza Congo would be nice. If we ever go to war, they can cause some trouble for Filthy there. Okay, when are we expanding to these horses? Six turns. I do have the gold if I want to buy that right away. That will cost me 45. That is totally fine. We already have our staples up, so definitely want to be working that. Working the food as well. Awesome. And choosing production. A little slow here. Let's put a turn into a temple. Um, that's fine. <laughs> Jimbo Winter asks who I paid off to get this amazing capital start location. It's a good question. If I knew, I might do it more often. Pop over this way, and uh, that mine is done. Let's see, we can go and mine up some more of these hills, or go over to help with this road. Alright, so it looks like our triremes really don't have too much to do. I mean, it was worth it if there was an island out there, especially if it was an island with access to some nice uh, sea resources or even uh, a bunch of nice high production hills. I would gladly sell that thanks to my unique ability. Uh, ben is starving. We could use some more food here. We could slow down our capital's growth slightly. growth in one turn and instead send food to the capital. I suppose that would be fine. Or we could move uh, this guy to Jakarta and then send food to Suribata. Suribata does have a bunch of nice tiles to work as well. Now we'll keep on sending food to Medan. Um, this city does have a lot of hills it can work, so uh, I'm happy to get it up in population. And here, let's go pop up our university. And we did still have a horse in the queue, did we not? Yes, one turn there. Awesome. 